to my channel guys i know it's been a little while since i've uploaded another video um just really haven't had any ideas of what to upload if i'm gonna be completely honest um it's been a crazy year yeah so we have to save money we have to <sighs> Be careful with everything we do so you know I have three kids and all so um, I'm home with them homeschooling sucks I know a lot of um, parents are out there doing the same thing and it sucks to say the least um, but yeah um, so basically I just haven't had the energy or anything to kind of like figure out what to do um what's a good idea so um yeah so i got on today because i had the best idea to do a um a video on the two apps that i am really loving right now um and the reason why i am um speaking about these apps it's because i know a lot of families are tight right now with you know budgeting um some parents are probably not back at work yet on un unemployment and i know how unemployment can definitely put a damper on the holidays and you know, who knows, maybe birthdays that are around. I mean, for me, I have um, a birthday that's literally two days after Christmas for one of my kids. And yeah, every year it's, it's hard. <laughs> but um, so this year and now I know a lot of families are going through a lot and money is tight. I thought that I can share two apps that I think could help a lot during this holiday season. I know that they kind of help me at times. And I will let you know one thing that I actually just discovered and why I think it's just awesome to have these apps. Anyways, if you are interested in finding out um, about these apps, then you can just keep watching. All right, so there are two apps that I want to talk about today, and I know I've spoken about one of them briefly, um, but the first one is, it's the Afterpay app. It looks like this. <laughs> okay, um, so let me talk to you a little bit about what, the, what Afterpay is. So Afterpay is a way for you to shop online for certain stores and brands um so you can see right here there's like the levi's sorry about my nails guys they're all messed up but there's the levi store there's forever 21 and then like i think you, yeah you can go over to the side and then there's aritza aritzia sketchers DSW, Fabletics, Finish Line. There's just a bunch. There's there's um, categories in like for makeup, for women, for homes, for babies, for skincare. There's Uggs, like shoes. Um, there's sportswear. There's um, workout where um there's everything everything on here um well most of everything is on here um you could if you can think of it and you shop online there like Ulta, Sephora, KKW, um what else? Kylie Cosmetics, you would most definitely find it on here. Okay, so the way this works is you go on to the store that you want and you shop. I picked, what did I pick? I don't even know what this is. Um, let's pick Levi's. 
Levi's. And it tells you they have, they're have they having a 40% off sale at the store before you click it, like on the little thing. All right, so this is the Levi's app. And um, they're showing like a little video there. What? Just what's going on here? Okay, so you get onto the website on the app. You go ahead and let's say, let's do women. Um, you pick a pair of something from this website. Let's do this 501 Stretch Skinny, $98, 40% off. You can use the 40% off code on with this. And then you'd put this um, in your bag. In your bag. But before you do that, if you guys look very closely around here, Yep, right here where it says $98. It says, or you can pay with Afterpay for four installments of $24.50. So that's what I'm trying to get at. They can split one. So this one right here is $98. So they split that into four payments. They pay it completely um, once you get the app and... You download it and they give you an amount. Um, you pay it, com complete. they pay it completely. You only pay the first month, which is $24.50. They ship it and then in two weeks, they keep taking out the $24.50 um, until it's paid off. So it's every two weeks or you do have the option to pay it off earlier. Um, you can go into the app and just say, okay, I'm going to make that that payment and just pay it and you can pay it off earlier. Um, on this app, there are no like fees that are added to your installments, um, which is nice. The one thing that I did see that they started new is like having a card. So you can do like, it's almost like a credit card and I, you can go on to um to the stores to these stores and um and use it as long as they have like the tap and go you know like apple pay almost so you are to tap it on the thing double click and then the um passcode or face recognition and then um that's it. They take out the 24 whatever, the 2490 or something out of your account and you'd go home with whatever you purchased. Um, and then in the next couple of weeks, there'll be the payments and then another two weeks, another payment and so on and so forth until it's paid off. Um, you can actually, as long as you stay current with the payments, you can... Um, you can use um, it as much as you want. Um, they do have a pre-approved to spend amount. They didn't have that before, but all of a sudden they started with that. Um, I'm going to say it's because of the next app that I'm going to talk to you guys about. It's probably just competition. Um, but in all reality, Afterpay is kind of beating them just a little just because um they don't have any extra fees for those installments um so yeah after pay you just go on to your uh, app store and you download it and you can see what kind of stores they have and then you can keep up with um new stores that come up if you you know, if you have notifications set up for Afterpay, they'll let you know like, hey, such and such store just signed up with, you can pay now with Afterpay. And that way you can keep up with, um, with the stores that you can use it at. So that's Afterpay. Afterpay was actually the first one I've ever used. Um, oh yeah, I forgot to tell you guys, if you're late... I think it's if you're late a couple weeks or something like that, or a few days, they add, that's when the fee comes in. They add in a $2.50 fee. Um, other than that, 
there's I've never had a fee other than if you had it shipped to your house, you know, then you had to pay the shipping, you know, the whole internet situation. But that's the only fee that I've ever seen or heard of um, that they that they give you. Um, so the next app that I have here is Quad Pay. Okay, so now Quad Pay is a little different. It's it it does almost the same thing, but it's a little different because on Quad Pay now they they add a dollar for each installment. So it, uh, if you got something for a hundred bucks, just be aware that you're going to be spending one oh four because it's going to be divided into four installments so instead of paying $25 every two weeks you're going to be paying $26 so that's the one downfall with it but four dollars isn't really a big deal if you're actually getting the merchandise before you pay it off and you can pay it off little by little um I feel like it's very good with Christmas coming around right now um this is something will be easy on your pocket. One thing that I did realize that you can do on this app is it has like a credit card. I don't want to show you guys it because then you guys will have my information. But they give you like a credit card and I wasn't aware that you can actually use it in different places. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to be completely transparent with you guys. I was a little bit behind on my cable bill. Okay, Spectrum. Just trying to tell you, you need to get better with your internet. But anyway, um, my cable bill was a little behind. And we're trying to get together for, um, for Christmas, you know, decorate the house, do all these little things. And I mean, at the moment, I just was like, I can't pay the whole thing right now, you know? Um, my brilliant little mind <laughs> um, had an idea. I went onto the app and I was like, hey, how come I can't use that credit card information for Spectrum? Because I had looked up first to see if Spectrum was one of the stores um, and it was not. So I just had this idea. I'm like, you know what? Maybe that'll work. So I went on to the Spectrum website um, and I put in the credit card information. And your girl only had to pay the one installment for now, which I will be paying the rest <laughs> um, this week. We just needed to get it paid um, ASAP. So, you know, right ideas that I get. So I went, ahead, I went ahead and I tried it out and it worked. So I, I paid a bill that I was going to pay anyway the next couple of days, but I just couldn't do it at that precise moment, which is when they wanted me to pay it by. So I, I did it through Afterpay and now I had a little bit of leeway, some money still left over to play around with because I was already gonna pay it in the next couple days anyway. So now, coming in a couple days, I will pay the whole complete bill off. Uh, but yeah, um, it saved us from having A, our internet shut off, B, um, any of the fees that they um, add, and all of that situation. So also, this could also work if you want to spend your cash on um, Christmas stuff and, you know, all that good stuff. And, you know, you just need a little bit of time to pay off a bill. Try it out. It works. So, um, yeah, that's what I did. Quad pay, again, is almost the exact same thing as after pay. Um, like I said, they have that one little thing where it's a dollar for each installment for each payment installment um and they 
have more stores than Afterpay does. Afterpay has a lot of stores that I'm not a, I, I've never heard of, uh, but Quadpay has a ton of stores that you guys could probably get good use off of it. There's uh, Best Buy, there's Foot Locker, there's Nordstrom, there's what else? Macy's, there's uh, I think there's even like higher end stores, so like Louis Vuitton, um, Gucci, I believe I saw on here. Um, there's StockX if you're looking for some sneakers that you can't otherwise buy at the stores. Uh, and like I said, Target is also on here and you can go into the store at Target and shop, be it food, house things, decoration, kids for the clothes for the kids, um, necessities, soap, deodorant, toothbrushes, whatever. You get what you're going to get and you pay with quad pay at the register with the tap. It has to be tap because it's not a legit like card. It's it's your Apple Pay that really it goes through. So, um what you do is you download it on your phone from the App Store. They're going to ask you a few questions. You some some people may or may not qualify. They don't check your your credit, they say. I'm not sure what makes you qualify and what makes you not qualify, but um, it's worth checking it out if you need a little bit of help now in these um, hard days and the holiday seasons and all of that jazz. So, um, yeah, you know, just look and see if you qualify for a spending amount. I know that when I first uh, applied, not applied, but download the app, they only gave me a $200 spending limit in the beginning. The more I used it and I paid things off, they boosted my my uh, spending amount significantly. So now I still grab things on there and I pay it off and I'm pretty sure it'll boost up my spending limit. Uh, I don't know how that works. If you guys know, let me know. I'm not really sure what they, um, how they determine what to give you and when to give you a, a boost in your spending amount. So yeah, I just wanted to come on here, quick little video, and I wanted to share something that could probably help families out there and this time of need that I know it's very hard right now. So, so let me know what you guys think. Let me know if you guys have this app, how you like it. Um, let me know if you have any more in-depth information about it uh, as far as like if you know how you qualify or don't qualify, what determines your spending amount. If you guys have any information, just put it down below into the comments. I'd love to know. And if you have questions, I will also love to answer your questions. I could try to get uh, more information and be a little more specific if you guys need me to be down below in the um, in the comments. Um, so yeah, if you guys found this helpful, helpful to yourself, just hit the like button. And if you think someone else would find this helpful in this season, just press the share button and share this with people. Share it with different families that may need a little bit of help right now um, and a little bit of time to pay things off. It's totally worth it and I've seen it's it's worth it. Um, so yeah, and don't forget if you're not subscribed to subscribe down below or yeah, down below. Um, and my KKW perfumes, I did get them on Afterpay. I'm gonna link up the KKW, uh, what you call it? video up here so you guys can check that out uh but yeah that's how i got that there's i'm telling you guys there's just so much to be seen on these apps and so much help all right so thank you guys so much for watching i love you guys all stay safe